Hey guys, Chef Justin23 back here again, and this is going to be a contest entry to Absolute Sublime One, and um, I and in his giveaway, his horror giveaway that he's doing, um, he's giving away two copies of um, Girls Gone Dead, and um, this is my video entry for it, and he only asked one question, but you, he asked several things to do in his video, like, you know, like, fave, fave the video, and stuff like that. And um, I, and he asked one question, and the one question that he asked is, "What is your favorite comedy horror movie?" Um, there's plenty of them out there. You can name so many out there in the top of your head. You know, like um, the most recent one I could think of was um, Zombie Land was great. You know, there's Gremlins that was a good one. Um, there's so many out there. Shaun of the Dead was great. Um, but the one that I definitely picked out of all those comedy horror movies, and and it's like one of my top favorites. And um, me and my dad love this film. Whenever it's on TV, him and me always watch it. And um, it got to be the third installment movie of the Evil Dead series. Um, and it is Army of Darkness with Bruce Campbell. So that's my favorite movie. Um, the Army of Darkness. I actually own the Screwhead Edition, but I don't have it, so I'm just telling you. So I hope you can accept my entry for that. So, <laughs> um, yeah, the the that's the that's the one I pick. That's the one I pick. It's a such a hilarious, and also it has that horror theme to it. You know, uh, the movie is basically about um, Ash getting sucked into a time portal, um, and he gets back to. 13 AD or something like that back in um middle m mid I mean medieval ages there you go the mid the medieval ages with like King Arthur and stuff like that and um he gets captured and he has to he gets captured by I think actually I think it is he gets captured by King Arthur's men and he has to um get back his supplies like his chainsaw and stuff like that his chainsaw arm you know um a car flew the through the portal and they threw him in this pit and he survived the pit um because inside there's like a witch and like a monster in there and stuff like that and he survived because he had his boomstick and and he just fought him off and stuff like that and he came out of the pit and um all the people were amazed by how you know like how he did he survive that blah, blah blah and basically they ask him um they ask they ask ash to help out the town because they're over the town is over uh a curse or something so he has to go out in the woods and get the necronomics book and uh he gets out there and he forgets the words. That's the only part I remember because it, it was so funny because he's like, no, 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 you know, he like coughs in it and stuff like that. And he looks around, you know, he's like, huh, oh, nothing's happening. So he takes the book and he leaves. Next thing you know, a clone, you could say of Ash, is, which is the, um, the bad clone, comes after him with the Army of Darkness. And basically it just goes to a slaying scene and stuff like that. It's such a great film. I highly recommend it, and that is my definitely my favorite and my pick of um, comedy horror. So yeah, uh, definitely check that out and definitely sub to Absolute Sublime if one if you haven't. So I'll have his link down below, uh, and also a link down to his uh, to his contest if you haven't. So definitely subscribe and enter his contest. It will be ending soon. So yeah, uh, till next time, I'll see you guys.